And we're back at the JobsOK.com Career Fair at the Oklahoma State Fairgrounds. I'm Dave Morris for NewsOK.com. Our sister site, JobsOK.com, which handles, as you might guess, careers and jobs, is sponsoring this career fair. It's free. Come on out. It's here at the Oklahoma State Fairgrounds in the Expo Building until around 2 o'clock this afternoon. But if you can't make it out here, we're doing a live webcast on NewsOK.com, and I'm speaking with various businesses and employers about what they're seeing in the job market and perhaps what specialized needs they have. And perhaps if you're out there watching, you might say, wait a minute, I can match up the chocolate and the peanut butter. I've got the specialized skill set for something that they're looking for. You never know, or maybe such as in my case, you're just learning. And I'm about to learn here is Don Barnes with J.D. McCarty Center for Children is joining us. And Don, thanks so much for your time. Thank you very much for talking with us. Absolutely. J.D. McCarty Center for Children, tell me about it. We are a facility for children with devel developmental disabilities, and we take care of children from birth to the age of 21 and all aspects of their care. We are a facility pretty much unlike any other. We take care of them as far as we provide therapies. We have 24-hour nursing care. We do have direct care specialists that are with the children one-on-one, -on -one. and uh, we do have uh, Norman Public Schools on site for the children. They do field trips. We have a camp that is fixing to start its second year, which has been very successful. We have a pond on site. They fish, they canoe, they do arts and crafts. We have cabins. Everything you could think of is there for these children. Well, so, how long have you guys been around? Um, I knew you were going to try to get me on that actual date. It's been <laughs> back since like the 60s, but we used to be okay. located on Alameda and 12th okay. in Norman. And of course, that building is there no longer. So when we moved into our new state-of-the-art facility in October of 2004, 2004. So you've been at the new facility for about 10 years. Yes. Tell me about that and, and what makes it different? Uh, it's just basically everything that we can offer the children. It's just amazing to see how children come in and then how they leave there, the relationships that get built with the children. The care we give is outstanding in my opinion. I've been there over 18 years. Um, it takes very special people to do this job and we have a lot of great workers from uh, the ones that care for the children through our nurses, through our administration, social workers, food service, everybody we have there all has one goal and it's to take care of these children and provide the best care that we possibly can for them. There are jobs, there are careers, and then there are fulfilling careers. And I think what you guys are doing there has to be very fulfilling and amazing work. Yes, we, we believe so. We, we, we love our job. We're, we're very happy. Like I said, the relationships you make with these children uh, they pull at your heartstrings, and I mean, it's something you will remember forever. And like I said, it takes a very special person to be able to do this. Well, let's get into that. We're talking with Dawn Barnes. She's with the J.D. McCarty Center for Children. She's the HR management specialist there. Okay, so what, do you, what are your needs and what sort of worker are you looking for? Right now, we're basically, we're looking for direct care specialists, and that's similar to a nurse aide position. They do take care of the children one-on-one -on -one in a house, home, excuse me, home type setting and um, basically are just with the children through therapies, things of that sort, and then we do have 24-hour nursing care, which we are looking for registered nurses, and our nurses do do 12-hour shifts, and um, we take applications basically anytime. You can come in between 8 and 3, Monday through Friday, put in an application. We do keep applications on file for a year, so we'll take them for any position, but right now that's currently what our need is, is in those two areas. Yeah, I was going to ask you, what are the hours and you know what, what's kind of the shift and that sort of uh, Administration hours are 8 to 4, and but the facility itself as far as patient care and nursing and things of that is 24 hours. So, well, what are you guys seeing in the job market? Are there plenty of qualified candidates or maybe not so much? Uh, I would think basically what we've seen lately, in my opinion, there is a shortage. So, um, and especially in this type of environment, when you're dealing with children with special needs, it's really not something everybody can do. So it's, um, it, it, it is very rewarding, but it is tough at the same time. We were just so, talking with Adam over at Grace Living Center, and he said something very similar. He's like, a lot of people have uh, a nursing license or degree, mm -hmm. um, but it takes a special type to deal with his patients, and I'm guessing you're, you exactly. see the same thing. Exactly, because some of the things, it'll just rip your heart out on some of the things you see, but it's I did nurse aid work for the first five, six years I was there, and it was very rewarding. You actually leave there knowing you've done good and benefiting the patient that you're with. So, and it's very hard not to fall in love with them. I'll tell you that. So, well, I'm sure that is the case. It, but it is. How fulfilling is that when you leave the office at the end of the day and you're like, 
yeah, I did something, or I saw a look in that kid's eye. Exactly. Or they come in not being able to do much at all, and they leave walking and talking, and our therapists there are great, and I've seen many things that are just amazing miracles that have happened there. So just from our dedicated people that we have. Well, Don, I'll give the opportunity at this point, the J.D. McCarty Center for Children. How can people contact you? And if they think, hey, I'd, I'd like to come work for you, how do they get in touch? Okay, our main website is jdmc.org. And you can send resumes in to resumes at jdmc.org. Or you're welcome to come in during business hours, 8 to 4, Monday through Friday, as long as it's not a holiday, and just come to the reception desk, request an application, and we'll be glad to give you one. We do keep applications on file for a year. She's Don Barnes, ladies and gentlemen, with the J.D. McCarthy Center for Children. Thanks so much for your time this Thank morning. You very we much. appreciate it. I appreciate it. you talking with us. And she'll be out here at the JobsOK.com Career Fair until 2 p.m., or at least representatives from her place will be here until 2 p.m. at the Oklahoma State Fairgrounds. And I will be back shortly to talk with yet another employer in local business, and we'll kick it back to the other camera now.